The Viking spacecraft that landed on Mars in July 1976 took some of the mystery out of the Red Planet. There are no water-filled canals, there are no Martians. And in place of the lush vegetation once thought to grace the canal banks, Viking's television cameras and other instruments showed a rock-littered desert landscape smothered in iron oxide dust. The two Voyager spacecraft that flew by Jupiter in 1979 gave us spectacular close-up views of the planet king and five of his 14 moons. As Voyager 1 neared Jupiter, the tiny spacecraft crossed the planet's bow shot, a mammoth wall of charged particles bordering Jupiter's powerful magnetic field. The chirping sound is made by electrical charges dancing about near the edge of the shot. many Jupiter surprises was that the giant planet, like Earth, is alive with whistlers and with chirps of a dawn chorus. With radio telescopes, astronomers tune in signals sent out by stars and by galaxies far beyond our own. Among such star sounds are some from special stars called pulsars. These are the rapidly rotating exposed cores of supernovas, stars that have blown off their outer shells of gas in catastrophic explosions. Pulsars hurl radio signals across the vast distances of the galaxy, much as the rotating beacon of a lighthouse sweeps its light beam around. One pulse for each rotation. We can hear this pulsar rotating four times a second. The younger a pulsar, the more rapidly it spins. Some rotate too fast to count by ear. We can hear a pulsar's rhythm in finer detail when we slow down the tape. Here is the pulsar Vila X at normal speed, about ten times a second. And here, slowed down to one quarter speed. the objects in the universe, black holes are among the most mysterious. Black holes are so dense that no energy can escape from them, not even light, so we have no way of detecting them directly. Astronomers suspect that black holes may lie at the center of many galaxies, such as this one known as M87. A clue to the black hole's existence are mysterious radio pulses coming from the heart of the galaxy. Perhaps the universe is a vast stage on which the mystery of creation is still being acted out. Do intelligent beings inhabit the dark depths of space yearning as we yearn to hear a voice from afar? Many astronomers feel that advanced life abounds in the universe. At this very moment, 
a message written by Earthlings and beamed into space by the Arecibo radio telescope is crossing the universe at the speed of light. intelligent civilizations out there, perhaps one of them, one day, may hear that message. If they do, they will know they are not lonely witnesses to the wonders of the universe. And perhaps we ourselves someday may receive a message from other beings, a cosmic greeting every bit as wondrous as the origin and evolution of life on planet Earth.